what is the power of spontaneity? The power of spontaneity. I mean, you know it. It's um, you. You can actually be truly spontaneous when you are your authentic self. When when you know your creative being is unobstructed. So it's called a natural flow. So you have that creativity or creative being, which is at the same time, your natural being is unobstructed. So in other words, it's called a natural free self-expression, right? So you express yourself um, without employing thoughts or uh, having some kind of premeditated ideas about how you should act or shouldn't act or what other people may or may not think or how they're going to take you, your behavior. So uh, natural being doesn't have this residue mental or emotional. So everything comes naturally. It's like a free um, outpour of your natural being where you either speak or act so-called from the heart, right? So, and you can't be wrong in such expressions. For example, love or natural expression of benevolence, blessing is usually, uh, or are usually examples of such spontaneity, right? But also can be rage. So if uh, one's consciousness is burdened by negative emotions, this expression will be somewhat negative. So people can also um, express themselves negatively, spontaneously. And that's all right, as long as it feels sort of natural to them. Or they say, hey, I don't like it. Or they uh, express themselves spontaneously, naturally, even in a negative way, they shouldn't feel uh, kind of, they shouldn't condemn themselves or feel guilty about it just because they have afterthoughts or their religion doesn't permit it or they have afterthoughts about it. Oh, it means I'm a bad person. So if we aren't spontaneous, it means we are in our thoughts, in our mind rather than our natural selves.